Saint Gorgonius or Gorgoni of Nicomedia, Martyr, 300. Here followeth the life of Saint Gorgoni. Saint Gorgoni and Saint Dorothy were in Nicomedia, chief in the palace of Diocletian, and renounced their chivalry for it to follow their everlasting king. And confessed with a high voice that they were Christian. And when the emperor heard that, he was strongly angry, and it did him much displeasure and grievance for to lose such men, which he had nourished in his palace, and were noble of manner and of lineage. And when he saw that he might not turn them by menaces and e by fair words, he did do strain and pain them in the torment of Achille, and did all to rend and break them with scourges and hooks of iron, and to cast in their wounds salt and vinegar, which entered into their entrails. And they suffered it joyously. Then he made them to be roasted upon a gridiron, and they lay thereupon as they had lain upon a bed full of flowers and suffered none harm. And after this the emperor commanded that they should be hanged with cords, and their bodies to be given to hounds and wolves to be devoured. And so they yielded up their spirits to Almighty God, but their bodies abode untouched, and were taken up and buried by good Christian men. And they suffered death the year of our Lord 280. Then many years after, the body of St. Garagoni was transported to Rome, and the year of our Lord 774 the Bishop of Metz, nephew of King Pepin, transported the same body to France and laid it honorably in the monastery of Gathagotians.